volleyball. But yeah, it was fun. It was a good time. Parcher's already right at it. Right at it. Oh, hello, KK. Hello, KK. Hi. That says your golf is nice. How was your walk? Yeah. Well, it's my league night, but I'm going out with Joshua instead. Josh McKenzie. He's getting me out at good old Cherry Hill, so it's my first time playing there. It's a very nice course. It's fully private, so I'm excited for that. I've never golfed there before. I'm sure me and Josh will have a jolly good time. You know, I'm sure we'll have a jolly good time. But we'll see. Uh, was it outside or in a gym? It was beach volleyball. So it was great. You got to play barefoot, a little bit of beach volleyball. It was, it was fantastic. You know, I loved it. Yeah, Parker's going crazy, dude. Holy. Are you good, man? Are you good, bro? What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, it was a great time. What? What are you doing? What, 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 what? You only tolerate the sand for volleyball, yeah. That is absolutely true. That is absolutely true. I do. You're correct. You are correct. Hello. Maria, it's your birthday. Happy birthday. Much love to you. I hope you had a great day today. Happy freaking birthday. <laughs> oh, Tyler and Dawson. They're not usually on this late. Good evening. Good evening. But yeah, Cherry Hill tomorrow should be good. Should be very good. I'm excited. Very nice course. Very nice. Very nice. Hello. Jimi Hendrix? No, I believe it is the Notorious Big E. Big E, I think. Yeah, I don't know. I'm pretty sure that's what it is, though. Don, I don't know. I don't usually decide until, like, right before. I don't plan it out, really. Biggie Smalls. Biggie Smalls. All right, yeah. You got it. You got it. Hello. Hello, hello. Hello. <coughs> What's going on? I 
everybody's on right now. You got Tanner, you got Charlie, you got Jesse, you got Noah, Tyler, Dawson, Shreds, Edward. Oh, we never, we never joined up with Edward, but everybody else. I have mosquito bites everywhere. Everywhere. I have one right here, but it's going away now. I have one somewhere on my arm. This arm right here. I got one right there. Tyler's moving to Nashville. Yeah, I saw that. I saw that. Don't scratch. It's tough. It is tough. When is he moving? Aloe? Ma, the aloe plant died, didn't it? The big one? Yeah. No, it's still there. No? Yeah, it's still alive. She's outside. Oh. I thought it died. I scrolled in and saw everyone taking my name and got so confused. <laughs> Brandy. He's keeping the AZ place. Arizona. Arizona. I miss AZ. You should tell them that you ran into your cousin and you're taking them to the rodeo and yeah, true. I did. I ran into my cousin, Ben, tonight. And for any of the locals, there is that rodeo that happens in Stevensville. And that is my cousin who hosts it. So, yeah, I don't know. Anyways, I saw him tonight at volleyball. He ended up being a sub for another team as well, same night. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go to the rodeo this year. It's early August. I think August 2nd, 3rd, 4th, and 5th, or something like that, around there. Around there. So I'm going to go to that. We're going to go live there. It'll be good. They've got, like, it's a proper rodeo, you know? I've never been to a proper rodeo before. I don't really know what to expect. But my buddies have been the few years before, and they've all loved it and said it was a great time. So I'm looking forward to it. We're going to go live there. It's not too far. It's literally not that far away from us. It's only like not even a five minute drive away. So just going to zip on right down the road, go to, uh, and go to the rodeo and, and see what's, uh, what's shaking there. So that'll be pretty cool. Early August, very beginning of August. That'd be good. I've never been, but I believe that they are, I, I believe it. I believe they're a good time with real cowboys. Yeah, real cowboys. I'm gonna come with you. All right. I don't even know what to expect. I've never been to a rodeo, you know? Have you? Mm -hmm. Do you know what to expect? No, but I'm curious to see his farm now. He's done so much work. I know, yeah. I don't know, that was the one thing I was like, oh, yeah, I keep him busy. And he's like, Pfft. oh, and I'm like, yep, yeah, I, I don't even know why I asked. Mm -hmm. I was like, should have known, should have known. I saw Courtney when I was at the grocery store the other day. She's really grown up. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. I haven't seen them in a while. Yeah, All right, Parker. Yeah. And then it would be fun. Yeah. And I have a friend who's probably going to be in it. Yeah, that'll be fun. Oh, that'll be cool. A cowboy? What? A cowboy? No, it's a girl. Oh, a cowgirl? Mm -hmm. So, then he has concerts, too. Oh, concerts. Ah, yeah. uh, well, I knew he did, like, a couple different things, but... Mm -hmm. Huh, that'll be cool. Wear real shoes, not Crocs. I actually wore my Crocs to volleyball tonight, my Croc sandals. But, like, it's beach volleyball, so it's appropriate footwear, you know? It was appropriate. To a rodeo, I would not wear my Crocs, no. 
I would not wear my Crocs, all right? Don't worry. I would not do that. Have you changed a diaper before? I have changed a diaper before. Yeah, indeed. Indeed I have, yeah. Indeed I have, odd question, it is. That is definitely an odd question, out of the blue. I do not own cowboy boots, no, I do not. I was going to buy a pair last year, I think, at some point, but I did not. Um, I should have. I definitely should have, but I didn't. I did not. I need to give my cowboy hat a good delinting, though, before before that rodeo. It definitely needs to be delinted. It's in a rough shape right now. It needs to be restored. You know what I mean. It needs to be restored but we'll get it there we will it just might take a little bit of time but that's fine it's fine yeah we just need the hat you know we don't need the cowboy boots it would be a good fit but we don't need them we don't need them they're fucking expensive cowboy boots are fucking expensive like, they were a couple hundred dollars just for, like, a, a decent pair. Like, that's fucked. It's outrageous. It absolutely is outrageous. They are pricey. You can get like the really cheap ones, you know, but then you're kind of get like you get what you pay for. Like you can buy the cheap ones, but you know, they're going to be very uncomfortable, probably going to be not so durable. So you're going to burn through them real quick. And like for a decent pair, it's like 200 bucks. It's fucked. It's crazy. 600 dollars. Holy fuck. That's a lot. That's a lot of money. That is a lot of moolah. Lori, hello. 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 Uh, Christine, yeah, I still have a pair of those, yeah. I do and yes I already know what you're gonna say they are more pricey than cowboy boots but it like whatever all right you can wear those on a more like a more day-to-day -day occasion than I would wear cowboy boots so that's why I, um, I got them all right I still wear them to this day Cowboy boots wouldn't be like an everyday kind of every occurrence kind of thing. Like, you know, you're kind of limited to what you can wear them as. Like, you know. I bet Kuhn's dad could find a bargain pair. I bet. I bet you're right. I bet you're right. 100%. The area boots? What are area boots? They look like cowboy boots, but they're still like 200 bucks. They are still 200 bones. No, I'm 15. You're back. It's a brand. 
Well, there's still 200 bones at least. At least. The cheapest pair. $204. They look like cowboy boots. Well, I mean, I guess it's just a brand, but yeah. Boot barn. Lasts for years. That's, that's fair. I'm sure they do. I'm sure they do. Hello. Hello. Need some good shit kickers for a rodeo. <laughs> shit kickers. <laughs> Never heard them referred to as that before. I like it. I like it. Some shit kickers. Will he let you lasso a bull? Um, probably not. I feel like that would be a big safety concern, you know? I feel like that would be quite the safety concern. And, and on top of that, I wouldn't want to lasso a bull, I don't think. You know, I like my life. I like my life. I don't want to dance with a bull. I have no intention on getting in that ring with a bull. Um, In no way, shape, or form could I see that ending in, in well at all. All right, I, I can't see that ending well at all. So I would just avoid that situation altogether. I would say. For sure. Good content. No, it's, it's not worth it though. You know, you weigh the pros and the cons there and like the cons definitely outweigh the pros. Because if that bull gets a hold of you, it's game over. You know, you're not getting out of there without some sort of serious injury. So like you're kind of fucked. So I would just, I'm good. You know, at the end of the day, I'm okay. I'm good. I don't need to. I don't need to tangle with a bull. Doesn't need to happen. Does not need to happen. Ma, would you get mad if I tried to, uh, if I got in the ring with a bull? She would be mad. She'd be upset. Not mad, disappointed. She'd be disappointed. Yeah, you mess with the ball, you get the horns, you know, and I'm not trying to get the horns. I'm good. I'm a okay, you know, I'm good. I am just fine and dandy. Thank you very much. Elizabeth, exactly. Exactly. Rhonda with the dancing beaver. Much love, Rhonda. Thank you very much. Thank you. A thank you. That's a line from The Breakfast Club. I don't know if I've ever seen The, Bref the Breakfast Club, to be honest with you. And I know that's a classic movie. I know that's a classic, but I don't think I've ever seen it before. Don't say that. No, I, I, I'm being honest, all right? I'm just being honest. I have never seen The Breakfast Club before, or at least not that I can recall. So I probably have not seen it before. Don't be mad, okay? It, it just happens. It just happens.
high school musical guy. Who, me? Are you referring to me? I wouldn't say I was a high school musical kind of guy. You know, I definitely watched it, but I wouldn't say I was a high school musical kind of guy. I didn't watch it on repeat. Yeah, that was Coon. That was Coon. He knows the soundtrack off by heart. He's got it down. Bianca, have a great night. Have a great night. <laughs> Star Wars guy, exactly. You got it. I was more of a Star Wars kind of kid. You know, high school musical, sure, I dabbled. I dabbled. Who didn't? You know, that's just like saying you didn't listen to Justin Bieber's music when he was just coming out because you know you did. You might not have publicly have done it, but you did. Same with High School Musical. You might not have publicly said you have watched the movie, but you did. You know what it's about, you know? So it wasn't like I wasn't a repeat offender kind of guy. Like I didn't watch it like enough times to be like, oh, I know these scenes right off by heart. I know exactly what you're referring to, but I definitely have watched it once or twice. That's about it. You know? No. Is it good? Mabel's? What'd you get on it? Well, what kind of stuff? Well, like what? Hog peppers, pepperoni, the basic, the Caitlin classic. Super Troopers, great movie. Do you boys like Mexico? I love that movie. Super Troopers 2 was good. A little bit more fucked up, but it was good. Not as good, but it was good. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Wait, you have how many diamonds? A million. Mom, what the fuck? You exploited the shit out of that game. <laughs> Last oh I saw God. you, when you showed me, you had 100,000 and something. No, I had like 800,000. Oh, 800,000. So Holy many. shit. Well, what can you do with diamonds? <laughs> she said she normally has 5,000. <laughs> you normally have 5,000 and you have a million. What can you do with diamonds? Is that like coins? Yeah, you can buy stuff. Like power ups and stuff? Yeah. What the fuck? But <laughs> my mom's been playing a, a game kind of like Candy Crush, but not really Candy Crush. It's more like Solitaire. Is it kind of like Solitaire? It's kind of like Solitaire, but you have to like go either one up or one down. Yeah, so it's kind of like Solitaire, but you go one up or one down. And. The game, her game ended up glitching out and she was just able to k keep collecting a prize. Just boop, 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 boop. So she just kept collecting the prize and now she's just accumulated a fuckload of power-ups, diamonds, and <laughs> and everything, really. Everything. She'll never run out of lives or power-ups ever again, I don't think. Ever. <laughs> she exploited the fuck out of it. For like the last day and a half. Does it work still or is it done oh, now? It's done. it's done. It doesn't work. They patched it. They finally patched it. But it's too late because they've already lost out on a fuckload. 
She's already... <laughs> she's done the damage. She has done the damage. Ay, ay, ay. Freckles. Yeah, we got some. We do. You are oh so tan. Thank you, Shannon. Thank you very much. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. Hi from Jersey. Hello. There's the 78 shooting son of a gun. Ha <laughs> 78, baby. Woo! Good old fucking 78. Well, not four, actually. You're not yelling four when you shoot at 78. That's not true, actually. There was one hole where I was definitely would have been yelling it. That is not true. Rocco Bucks coming our way, going towards the purchase of matching golf shirts. Yeah, Rocco Bucks. We're getting some Rocco Bucks. That round will win us some Rocco Bucks for sure. For sure. What are you giggling at? Why? No. Oh. Where is he? No. Oh. To what? Oh. Ew. Parker's chilling. Parker's chilling on his bed right now. Squeaking his toy. KK, did you get picked up on the lawnmower yesterday? Yeah. Yeah, yeah they stopped by here first. Oh. They were looking for you, then I was like, no, wrong house. She's at, she's at her father's. Then they're like, oh, she didn't spend. I didn't either. All I heard was a knock on the door, and I'm like, what the fuck? So I peeked out the window, and all I see is a 30-foot lawnmower sitting outside. I'm like, oh. And then he tried to pull a Jehovah's Witness thing off on me, and was like, oh, do you know about... I was like, oh, my. Yeah, and then I was just like... I was just like, oh, are you, are you looking for Caitlin? And then he's like, yeah. I'm like, yeah, she's at her dad's. Like, she's not here right now. He tried to pull it off. He was like, do you know about our savior? I'm like, what? And he said it with a straight face, too. And I was I like, know, what the he fuck? Like, oh, <sighs> with a straight face. Oh, God. oh boy. Oh, Rhonda 
not yet. I mean, yes, but no. We have, but not completely. Not completely. Bye. 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 Have a great night. What? Have a great night. Thanks. You're welcome. Who needs a plaque? What needs a plaque? Uh, Father, I could not tomorrow morning. I will not be able to tomorrow morning, unfortunately. But I'm going to Cherry Hill later in the day, so. Well, actually, I already told you that. I already told you that. Oh, KK's Bridge? Yeah, KK's got her own bridge that we've named after at Bridgewater. That is true. That is very true. Why do they yell for? I don't know, actually. I guess that sounds like a great question for Google. Why do golfers yell for? Golfers yell for it, but why? The true origin of the term for relating to golf has been heavily debated throughout history and will most likely continue to be discussed for a long time to come. Theory number one. One popular theory for yelling for is actually derived from the word for a caddy. The United States Golf Association defines a for a caddy as someone employed by the golf course or a player to watch where, the, where each golf ball falls. Theory two, artillery men of the olden days would shout, beware before, as a warning to nearby soldiers to drop to the ground before friendly gunfire. Beware before is a quite is quite a mouthful on the front lines of a war, so it was understandable to shorten the phrase to just the word for. Or theory number three, okay. The prefix for has roots in history dating back to the Middle Ages. It's commonly understood that the game of golf originated in Scotland. In Scottish, for is a word used that is short for before. However, in Old Scottish, for was used as a warning message. It meant look out ahead, which is why many believe that the term for in golf originated in Old Scotland. And that's all the theories that they have on that. That's it. That's it. That's all. That's it. That's all exactly the more you know i feel like number three is definitely the most logical and makes the most sense but i don't know it's just me it is just a me felt like story time a little bit, a little bit it did. Learned something new every day. Absolutely. Absolutely. Good evening, Gina. Good evening. Hello. Head talk by Alex. Golf Talk by Alex, yes. Four Talk. Rhonda, that is true. Very true. We should get a certificate every quarter for all the things we learn during lives. Like just one general certificate? Or like one certificate for everything you learn? Because that would be a lot of fucking certificates. That would be a lot of certificates. A lot. Hello. Hello, hello. I can print them. Bath is on it. Oh, in general? Just a general quarterly certificate. I got you. I want to go golf just so I can yell for.
Counts. I guess so. I guess it would count. Yeah, I guess. I suppose you were right. I suppose you are right. Who's the fact checker? Hello. Hello, ladies. Hello. What? I didn't call you. I didn't call you, Parker. What do you want? What do you want from me? What do you want from me, Baka Baka Baka? What? Go get Frederick. Go get Frederick. Get Frederick. No, go get Frederick. Where's Frederick? Go get him. Go. Go get him. He's not doing it. You want to go. 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 Mom, you should call your dog. Oh, Parker, did you hear that? Do you need to go outside? Parker, do you need to go outside? I was pumped. Thank you. Oh, thank you very much. I appreciate that. Parky, you make me sneeze, dude. No, you make me sneeze. Go. for me there's an emote we have some new emotes indeed the tat the good old tat oh yeah oh yeah yeah Parker go outside yeah yeah. Yeah. Christine, fine. Fine. I bless you, Emo, for all your sneezing. I know, I guess so. I guess so. No, Frederick, stop that. We've got... We've got the white Lulus, or the light gray Lulu lemons. The biggie shirt, you know? Hello, Frederick. 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 The Lulus, the Lulus. Indeed. Couple new tats in a few weeks. There you go. 
There you go. What's going on? What's shaking? Elizabeth, thank you. Thank you very much. Where are you from? Canada. Good old Canada. What time do you play golf? Not until like three later in the day. Later in the day. Three o'clock tea time. So that'll be good. You know, that'll be good. Finish by like seven, seven thirty. Hopefully, maybe even earlier than that, depending on how busy it is out there. But hopefully, no later than seven thirty. Doesn't usually take longer than four and a half hours. Um, but yeah. But yes, I want to try and squeeze in the live before that as well. Try and squeeze in. Train. Yep, we got the train. We have got the train. Rana. Garrett, why am I going to be shook? Why am I going to be shooketh? Why? Why? Are we in Canada? Look at Dawson, eh? Dawson's sitting up on number one right now. Look at him. Gotta find out. Alright. Alright. Just teasing, eh? Just teasing. What did you catch? Beth with the train! Much love, Beth. Thank you. Thank you. Tano and Echo are battling. Tanner and Echo are going at it, eh? I think Echo's scared of us now. I think he's scared. He's tired of coming in here and getting whooped. Tanner won the first battle. Got a boy T. Oh boy. Fuck. I don't know. I do not know.
voice to her if I'm good. Hello. Hello, hello. Am I cooking up nothing? Nothing. Nothing. Is all good. Deep thoughts, hardly. Hardly. Kimmy with the sub, much love. Kimmy, I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you. Hello, you Mr. Are, Ballcamp. You boys What's are up? feeling good, eh? How you doing, bro? Now, bro, it's been it's been a day, bro. Today, honestly, it's been it's been a crazy day today, man. Dude, I I see you sit up on uh, number one there. Good for you, man. Crazy, bro. Yeah. Doing our best, man. We're gonna see what we can do. We're gonna see what we can do. Right how you got you, a win streak? How you doing? I'm good, bro. You got a win streak? I might. I yeah. figured you'd have one for me, buddy. Do yeah. I? I do not have a win streak. I do not. I have the opposite of a win streak. We have negative. We have a negative we lost streak. <laughs> but we saved it all for you tonight. Oh, right. I like it. Buddy. I like it. All right, bro. All right. Guys, everything helps. Alex is going to be a great battle, but we have to all work together. He's got a very strong team, and they have a, probably a very big win streak, Let's knowing go. Alex. All right, brother. Best of luck. One, two, luck. three. Oh, oh, my baby, no, man. Oh, they're feeling good, ladies. They are feeling good. Here we go, all right? We have a 16-gamer, all right? We have a 16-game win streak. Let's protect the house. Let's protect the house. They are sitting at number one right now on the leaderboard in the States. They are sitting at number one. They're feeling good. They're not just feeling good. They're feeling fucking great, all right? And they're hungry. And they're going for the nuggies. We need to protect the house, ladies. Tappers, all of you. Teamwork makes the dream work. You already know the drill. You already know the drill. Sometimes all it comes down to are the taps, okay? So just because you're not gifting, do not think you're not doing anything, okay? You just sitting there going crazy is more than enough, all right? It makes a difference. It makes a difference. Every 30 taps is three free points, so... Tap away, all right? Let those fingers fucking fly, baby. Let them fly. Brrr, go crazy. Go crazy. Tap, 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 and just wait for the speed challenge. You know the drill. Wait for the speed challenge. Around three minutes, 10 seconds is usually when it comes into play. And if not, then, well, we just, we just see. We just see what happens. Marie, Rachel, much love, ladies. Here we go. Hello, Jess. Hello. Oh, I'm out of. I'm out of my. Oh, we have the speed challenge, ladies. We have the speed a challenge. A times two, what is it gonna be? Oh, just a little guy. It's just a fucking little guy. 60 points. That's a fucking gift. That's a gift. A speed challenge for 60 points. That's a gift. Tina with the hand hearts. Kiki with the roses. Gretchen as well. Smashing it out. We got it, ladies. We got it. She's starting soon. She is starting soon. We have 30 seconds of times two starting now. 30 seconds. Tina with the motorcycle right off the gate. Coming out with a motorcycle, baby. Here we go, Nikki. With. Yes. Incredible. Beth coming in huge with the last Drogan as well. Wendy with the uni as well. The triple threat showing. Showing up the triple threat. How you doing? Incredible. Y'all popped off. Y'all popped off. Our boy Alexander came out to play. He came out to play. Sit, my boy. Sit. My son. What was that? What was that? 
The shiny air balloon, Brandy as well. Much love, ladies. Incredible. The triple threat came out to play, made the most out of the times too. Absolutely incredible, ladies. Much love the toppers, all of you smashing it, tapping away. Going crazy. Going crazy. Protecting the house, the win streak. I'm just sipping on air right there. There's fucking nothing left in that sucker. That's brutal. That is brutal. Incredible, ladies. Incredible. Jess, have a great night. Thanks for stopping in and saying hello. Christine's tapping away at Gretchen. Gretchen! The triple threat, absolutely. Joe with the gem gun as well. Rhonda with the hand hearts. Elizabeth with the roses. Incredible, ladies. Much love. Y'all popped off. Popped off. Coon, Cooner's in here. Where is Coon? What did he? Oh, Coon with the finger hurts. Look at ya. Look at ya. Jay Coon coming in, sending some gifts as well. Look at the guy go. The coral from Jill. Much love. We are in the last 10 seconds, ladies. Y'all popped off. Incredible. Incredible. Team D has been going hard all day. They have been going hard all day. They are sitting at number one in the American rankings right now. They've been going crazy. They've been going crazy. Beth, Amy, Wendy, the triple threat, much love. All three coming in, throwing haymakers. Cannot thank you enough. That is incredible, ladies. Show them the love right there. Not far behind. You have Tina coming in, showing the love as well. You've got Kiki, Nikki, Brandy, Lynn, Rachel, and Jill, the tappers, all of you ladies. Teamwork makes the dream work. Y'all killed it. Much love, ladies. Just got an army, but guess what? We got team mother freaking D. Let's go, go. D. No, bro, 1 0, dude. Faith was. What's that? 1 0. All right, that best of three, then uh, that's, that's all? It. Yeah, that's all she wrote. So if you, right. if you beat us next game, then you sign off with their 18 and win streak and you just get to have sweet, sweet dreams about beating me and B and my buddy B. But oh, on the sleep. other end that we beat you, I'm going to sleep amazing. I'm going to be like, remember that time where I took your 18 or 17 game win streak, Alex, back in the pool? And you're going to be like, yeah, I've, I've thought about it every day since. So this is very important. I'm going to have 18 dreams tonight. All about you. And I'm going to remember every single one. I like your All goggles. You. Yeah. They're pretty cool. They're pretty cool. <laughs> Alright, y'all, this is our boys. final chance, bro. Final chance. Let's He's got go, an army. He's got an army. Go, He's All got right, an boys. army, but we got team B. We have the world. That's the we block. have the whole world. We have the whole world. Number one in the whole Alright, let's go, boy. I don't know why I said boys. Excuse me. I didn't mean to say boys. Let's go, ladies! Come on. Cobra Kai vibes. I know. I need to get my fucking bandana out here. Damn it. I need to get my bandana, but you know what the issue is? Look at this fucking thing, all right? Look at this fucking tan line. Oh, goodness. I, that's why I wear this hat all the time. It's because it's the only hat that hides my tan line. And it's so far gone that I can't really redeem it, you know? Like, yeah, it's like, yeah, sit in the backyard, lather up the fucking face and sunscreen, and just not on that. But it doesn't, it's not that simple. I'm dark right now, okay? I'm too far gone to fix that. I'm too far gone to fix that. You know what I mean? It, it, it's something that happens every year. You you know, the, the start of the summer starts to come around and you're like, okay, I'm not going to get the tan lines this year. I'm going to stay away from it. And no, all it takes is one day to kick it off. One day. And then it's just like the ship sails and then you kind of lose hope and then it just keeps going further and further down the trail and then you're pooched. Kathy with the sports car. The sports car out of nowhere. Much love, Kathy. Incredible. Tina with the motorcycle as well. We have the times two, the 180. Just another little guy right here. Y'all just went crazy. <clears throat> what do I do for work? Landscaping. 
landscaping actually i do some landscaping you know i dabble in the landscaping a little bit of landscaping a little bit of hardscape a little bit of get your hands dirty a little bit of don't you know a little bit of this a little bit of that that's it that's all we have the times two for 15 more seconds ladies here we go sassy cat with the fireworks amy with the fucking uni coming out of the gate incredible coming through with the uni wendy as well absolutely insane insane right there the double trouble knocking butts amy wendy popping off going crazy beth even throwing in the yacht as well beth throwing in the damn yacht the triple threat is like hey what's up how y'all doing incredible ladies absolutely incredible the money gun as well Y'all went crazy. Rachel with our boy Tom, the humpback whale, our boy. Much love, ladies. The corgi as well. The corgi farting those sweet hearts. Those sweet, sweet hearts. Incredible. Y'all popped off the tappers, all of you going crazy. You know the drill, ladies. I'm like a broken record. Say it all the time. I don't know what to tell you. I'm going to put Alexander back home. Put him back home. I keep going to take a sip of my Coke and it's just empty and it's not. No bueno. Carpal tunnel kicking in. Christine, it's okay. You don't have to go. It's all right. It's all right. I appreciate it though. The dedication is unreal. Unreal. Trigger finger. Brrr, going crazy. Jen with the hearts as well, Sylvia, all of you going nuts, Vicky with the motorcycle, y'all are still popping off, absolutely incredible, ladies, incredible, y'all went crazy, WGA, TWD, absolutely, hit the emote, hit him with the emote, Lynn, there you go, there you go, Vicky with the money gun, Don, yes, I know it's definitely a Are we back? A triple threat emote. We do need a triple threat emote. We do need a triple threat emote. There well, there are still more coming as well. There are still more coming. These first five that we just put in are just like a little intro into like kind of what's to come you know it's just like a boom coon threw them together got them quick within a day really it was pretty much within a day got the five good to go it was mint but we do have more coming we do have more coming so it'll be good it will be good but a big shout out again to the triple threat going crazy wendy amy beth much love ladies y'all are absolutely incredible showing the love much love ladies kathy is not far behind coming in at number four you have tina rachel sassy cat joe gretchen brandy much love ladies tappers all of you teamwork makes the dream work okay thank you so much it. dean thank you so much jennifer thank you so much and elisa luna lana and and everything helps us keep this number one that was spot. good teamwork y'all right there at the end that's what we're talking about we haven't got we haven't got number one in a very long time and tonight we're going to do everything we can to try to get it yo we, we never hardly ever push for ranks but we ended up here somehow some way and um i can't wait to celebrate with you guys tonight once we do it i know we're gonna do it and i can't wait to celebrate with y'all thank you for being here Hey, much love, bro. Like I said, you, you and William, bro, are two of my favorite people, bro. You guys are are, are just so selfless and just such good people, and I'm I'm grateful for to have you as a friend, bro. I really am. So, yeah, one of the much real love, ones, bro. bro. I appreciate that, and uh, good shit tonight, man. I uh, hold hold that lead, hold her strong, and uh, trying, finish bro. at number one. We love you, bro. Yeah, we, you got to come visit here soon, too, bro. You got to come visit. Dude, here soon. absolutely. I want to make it there before the uh, the summer ends. 100%, 100%, bro. Always welcome with me, bro. Much love, Alex. Bro. Much love, bro. Nice to have you in. Later, brother. Ciao, bro. Yeah. Woo! 
18 games, baby. Protecting the house. Y'all are going nuts. Much love, ladies. Y'all went crazy. Defended the house. Got the dubs. Good fun. It was good. WGA TWD. Incredible. Literally trying to drink air right now. C'est bon, très bon. Moi bien, mon ami. Qu'est-ce que le fuck? Tabanac? Tabanac. Tabanac. Okay, ladies, we are going to call it a night here, though. I am going to be back on tomorrow. All right. Stay tuned. 12 p.m. sharp EST. I'm going to be back on live. A little midday live. If you can make it, you can make it. If not, no worries. Appreciate you all for everything tonight. Protected the house. It was good. But we will be back tomorrow, like I said. Um... So stay tuned for that, 12 p.m. EST. Until then, have a great Friday, sleep well, and as always, a good night, and a love you bye. Adios, senoritas. I'm improving. I learned. NBD.